So on Tuesday night, England take on Brazil in a friendly, as both sides prepare for the 2018 World Cup in Russia, with the Samba Stars providing a much sterner test for the three Lions after their relatively comfortable qualifying group. This game will be a real test for Gareth Southgate's side and it could certainly be a wake up call for England as they find out how good they really are against the second best team in the world. To be fair, England could really be on the end of a battering from Brazil, especially with all the players who have pulled out of Gareth Southgate's squad. But just how good are their opponents? Let's take a look at Brazil's best starting 11 according to FIFA 18 ratings. In goal it's 83 rated Edison. The Manchester City goalkeeper made his Brazil debut in October, starting in a 3-0 victory over Chile, but FIFA already has the 24-year-old down as the country's best keeper. The 24-year-old moved to the Premier League this summer for 35 million quid from Benfica and has had a sensational start of life at the Etihad that has seen the club start the season unbeaten, with the only downside being Edison getting broke kicked to bits off Sadio Mane. By the time the World Cup comes around, Edison should have solidified himself as Brazil's number one keeper. At right back it's 84 rated Dani Alves. Despite being 34 years old, Dani Alves is still Brazil's best right back and is one of the best on the game with his rating of 84. Based on FIFA ratings, Neymar's best mate Dani Alves doesn't need to be worrying about his place in the side despite going into the twilight years of his career, with Galatasaray's Mariano and ex-Man United fullback Rafael the next best options with ratings of 79. At centre back it's 88 rated Thiago Silva. One of the best centre halves on the game, Silva is the best defender Brazil have got and is the second PSG defender in the back four. A former Brazil captain, Thiago Silva is also in the twilight years of his career like Alves, a year younger at 33, and is likely preparing for his final chance at World Cup glory with Brazil, no doubt having just got over the heartache of their failure in 2014 in their own country. He's alongside 86 rated David Luiz. To put things bluntly, it's all gone a bit tits up for David Luiz in the past week. The wacky head defender was first dropped by Antonio Conte for Chelsea's huge game against Manchester United, now Luiz isn't even in the Brazil squad for the upcoming friendlies, with one of their best defenders being snubbed for Monaco's Jemison, PSG's Marquinhos and Inter Milan's Miranda, who actually has an 86 rating just like Luiz, so could also be in this 11, but we wanted a bit more hair at the back, so Luiz still gets our vote. At left back it's 87 rated Marcelo. Speaking of big hair, Marcelo is the best of a great bunch of Brazilian left backs, with Alexandro and Felipe Luiz unable to match Marcelo's rating of 87. The Real Madrid fullback has one of the best jobs in the world really, because when he plays for his club he gets to link up with Cristiano Ronaldo down the left, and when he plays for Brazil he's got Neymar in front of him. In midfield we've got 83 rated Fabinho. The Monaco man can be deployed at both right back and centre midfield, but doesn't even get in the Brazil squad for the upcoming friendlies because apparently Tite doesn't pick his squads based on FIFA ratings. Fabinho was heavily linked with a move to the Premier League in the summer, with Manchester United a possible destination, but the 24 year old was one of few of Monaco's title winners who stayed with the club once the transfer window came round. Next up it's 85 rated Casemiro. One of the best holding midfielders in the world today, Casemiro has been a huge part of Real Madrid's success in the past couple of years, keeping the lost blank off ship steady, allowing the Galacticos in front of him to showcase their talents. While Madrid is struggling a bit this season, Casemiro is still performing and recently captained Brazil for the first time, having made his debut 6 years ago back when he was just 19. And our third midfielder is 82 rated Fernandinho. Our extremely defensive minded midfielder is rounded out by the Manchester City man, who heads on international duty after a great run of form with his club, with Fernandinho the pivot in the middle of midfield, with David Silva and Kevin De Bruyne either side. Will he start ahead of Barcelona's Paulinho or Chinese Super League star Renato Augusto? Maybe not, but at least he can take pride in his FIFA rating. On the right of attack is 86 rated Felipe Coutinho. The man that everyone wants to sign but still resides in Liverpool, Felipe Coutinho picks up an 86 rating on FIFA to make him an obvious starter in this 11. The playmaker is a target for both Barcelona and PSG, with Luis Suarez and Neymar trying to persuade the little magician to come and join them at their respective clubs. Is Coutinho a forgiven man for his desire to leave Anfield over the summer? Definitely not, but at least he gets another chance to play well at Wembley after his poor showing in Liverpool's defeat to Tottenham the other week. Through the middle is 83 rated Roberto Firmino. The man with the whitest teeth in football gets in ahead of the man with the strangest eyebrows as Bobby Firmino pips Manchester City's Gabriel Jesus, despite the City forward having been much more impressive this season. 
FIFA ratings has the Liverpool man ahead of Jesus, but it would be hard to argue that AEA have got this one right on the occasion, because Jesus has been almost unstoppable since moving to the Premier League, and has a pretty damn impressive record for Brazil too. And finally, it's 92 rated Neymar. Brazil's best player by a country mile, and the most expensive in the history of the game, Neymar rounds out our Brazil Super 11 according to FIFA 18. A true superstar of the game, Neymar's Brazil stardom is being rivaled by the emergence of Gabriel Jesus, but the PSG forward's ability can't be matched by the Man City man just yet. Neymar gave up the Brazil captaincy two years ago, but is already en route to 100 caps, and could be the man to break Cafu's record of 142 appearances for the country, and Pele's record of 77 goals. England, beware. So that's Brazil's best 11 according to FIFA 18 ratings. Let us know how you think the game will go down on Tuesday night between England and Brazil. Thanks for watching, and for more gaming content like this, check out HITC Top Corner.